This is Marina, and you are listening to High Energy Fitness Musical Health Talk. We're at a tempo of 132 beats per minute, so I encourage you, as always, to pull in those abdominals. Chest is high. Great big smile, yeah? It's your time. It's your musical health time. Even if you're just sitting in a chair and inhaling through the nose, exhaling through the mouth, to the beat of the music. Hear the music, feel the beat, and never stop moving in your body and your life. I'm being joined by Bob Caliban, Lynn Lipton, Brandon Osborne. This is Marina. You got it going on. Here's the real thing. I'm with the real thing. I'm with Bob Caliban and Lynn Lipton. How are you, Bob? I'm fantastic. Particularly just watching you. <laughs> oh, I love it. Lynn, how are you doing today? Me too. I am so impressed. I, I just talk off four pounds, I'll tell you. <laughs> oh, and Brandon Osborne, 68 pounds you've lost, yeah? Wow. Yeah, yeah. Love Six, it. Love it, baby. Yeah. Never stop moving. Never stop. You got it. love it. I just love the whole thing, Brandon. What'd you have for breakfast today? My usual oatmeal. You had oatmeal today. Oh, I loved it. Yeah, yeah. Oatmeal with blueberries and strawberries, a little bit of honey. You love that. I do. Wow. Yeah, so he, he loves this oatmeal thing, Lynn. Oh, that's great. What do you think? Is that an A plus for oh. low fat? Well, for somebody who is over 21. That's okay. It's a great way to start the day, <laughs> if Fabulous. you know what I mean. I know what you okay. mean, baby. I'm I one want of you. I my coffee burning hot, so hot it burns my lips. Forty, Lynn Lipton, Bob Caliban, and myself, Marina. I'm 53 now. How did that happen to me? I have no idea. Well, no, I was just a little girl when I met you, Lynn. <laughs> yes, and I was, I was pubescent. You were pubescent. <laughs> you were pubescent. Yes. I think so. <laughs> you know, Bob Caliban's in the room, so. Oh, this is, this, this is a master. This is the master. Master, master no. voiceover. You know, seriously, mm. he taught everybody how to do it. Lynn Lipton and Bob Caliban are probably two of the most famous. I like the word famous and fabulous. Famous and fabulous. Bob Caliban, Lynn Lipton, actors, voiceover extraordinaire. And when I came into the industry, in the commercial voiceover industry, they were always very nice to me because I was very frightened. It was very You're scary. So cute. Thank you, Bob. Oh. oh, we love you. Brandon, amazing that they're sitting here, I know, yeah? Right, right. I'm like sitting here just staring. Nice. Like legends. Right? Having better times in the studio at oh, Cayman Entertainment. My oh my God, <laughs> Lynn Lipton. <laughs> guys the idea is to never stop moving so again to our listeners reminder abdominal muscles in and up even if you're just sitting in a chair good for you i'm proud of you for working on you today for your musical health all right all right well that's enough of that i just love the whole thing this is marina you're listening to high energy fitness musical health talk and i am sitting here with bob caliban lynn lipton and brandon osborne bob caliban Bob Caliban, you did Law and Order, did you not? I did, I did. I played the judge a number of times. I just, I went to my club the other day, and one of the caddies said to me, Hey, Mr. K, I just seen you as a judge on Law and Order last night. You gave a shitty verdict. Oh, nice. <laughs> nice. <laughs> See, so he thought it was real, so you did a great job. It could have been reality TV. I mean, what the heck? <laughs> but that's all he said to me, not another word. You shitty verdict. Well, I know. I, 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 you know, your voiceovers and things. I'll go back. I mean, you're a little young for Top Cat. But I was always very impressed by that. Yeah, I did Top Cat. I did uh, a number of things. Uh, basically, I started out as an on-camera performer, but then they get tired of you so fast yeah. that uh, you try to get into other things. And basically... Uh, uh, character voices and, and, you know, 
animated voices, but sooner or later they let you do a straight thing. And oh, they're being you, nice. Do you know that he started at RADA? Is that so? Yes, he really? did. He studied at RADA. Unbelievable. Do you know what RADA is? Can please share with our audience? I might know, oh, honey, I'm but no, maybe nobody else yes. does. It's the Royal, the Royal Academy, Academy of Dramatic, Dramatic Art. Oh, you're a very fancy in person. London. Very fabulous. Yes. Incredible. I'm very honored here. And I'm loving the English accent right now, just like myself. Perfectly the same thing with my New York thing going on. Oh, yeah. yeah I like that. Totally. How totally. <laughs> am I doing? Very nice. Thank very you, lovely. darling. Yeah. Thank you. Fabulous. And Lynn Lipton, you mentioned you had a, a, an English accent thing going. You did like Sherlock Holmes on Broadway and everything. I did, did a lot of things. I, I was the English replacement when the RSC came <laughs> until, you know, oh, get Lynn. Get Lynn. Fabulous. You know, it was wonderful. Tell we them had, what RSC is, my dear. The Royal Shakespeare Company. Oh, oh, Royal Shakespeare. Yes, Shakespeare indeed. Company. And then at Second City, when where I started, really, in Chicago, you know, they just... They, they paid you and they taught you how to do it. And, yeah. I mean, so I was very lucky. Well, very you did the other one I love, which is Thundercat. Oh. <laughs> you know, I have to make these cartoon references because my maturity level is not very high. And, you know, I watched a lot of cartoons because I was a straight C student in high school. I like to brag about that a lot. I you know, love, uh, That was the do best it. job. It's the best job because yeah. you can overact and you get paid for it. You know, when we do this kind of thing. <laughs> Fabulous. Brandon, you know Thundercat? Oh, I love it, yeah. Of course, because you're, you're a youngin. I you're not an old like us. I wasn't allowed to watch it, but I would always sneak down and watch it anyways. Yeah. It wasn't R-rated. I know, but you know. Texas conservative. Yeah, he's one of those oh, Texas, Texas kids. Oh, really? Yeah, yes. Oh. People say it takes a sex him, boy. Come on. <laughs> yeah. I worked so hard to get rid of that. Tries to change it. He's a vocalist. This is Marina, and you're listening to Bob Caliban, Lynn Lipton, Brandon Osborne. We're now at a tempo. Of, I'm gonna still, I'm going to keep it here 132. So just feel the beat, people. Again, as a reminder, even if you're just sitting in a chair, abdominal muscles in and up. Inhale through the nose. Exhale through the mouth. You got it. Inhale through the nose. Exhale through the mouth. Good job. You know, here's the point, guys. Here's the point. You know, everybody says, I don't have time to work out. I don't have time to go to a gym. And a lot of people don't have the money. But we can certainly be sitting in a chair, sitting up nice and tall, or simply, if you can at home, be standing up and walking in place and being edutained, if you will. Edutained. Long enough to burn a calorie. I like that name. You like that edutainment thing? Yes, that's yeah. wonderful. Yes, yes, that's my word. Do you know I do this in my hot tub now? Do you? It's amazing that you say that. No, I do. Pulling in. I'm, I'm, I'm pulling in and stuff because I want to take off some weight. That, that, that doesn't do it, probably. You look but gorgeous. It makes me feel better. And I do it in my hot tub every night. There you go. I love that. Mm. I love that. And, you know, we don't date anybody. I only date myself. I'm 53. I love saying my age because I feel so much better now being 53. I wouldn't want to go back. I'm loving oh, it. No. I feel like my life is starting now. Mm-hmm. You know, and Lynn, I'm not going to say your age. I don't no, really know your age. I have no age. No age. Well, you look gorgeous. You're so sweet. Oh, my God. You look fabulous. You look exactly the same, like a little girl. Oh, really? really? Yes. Well, Bobby and I used to do these things together where he would interview me as a little girl. And how old are you, dear? I'm four. You're Eventually, four. I hope to direct. Oh. oh. <laughs> That's wonderful. And yeah. direct me? No, not necessarily you. Your mom and daddy. Yeah, that's oh, right. Good. I okay. have a lot of things to show them. We're getting a little, a, a little for another show. <laughs> a little for another show here. It's fabulous. You don't even know. I'm like felling. I just love the whole thing. This is Marina, and you're listening to High Energy Fitness Musical Health Talk. And I cannot believe I'm in a studio with Bob Caliban, Lynn Lipton, and the fabulous Brandon Osborne. Incredible, Brandon. No, you came from Texas. You're in New York, like working with like major pros. I know, right? That's Unbelievable. Great. Unbelievable. Unbelievable. Never stop moving, baby. Feel the beat. You got it going on. We're up to 136 beats per minute. Song is called "Put a Little Bounce in Your Step" from HighEnergyFitness.com because every day you want to just feel energized. You got it going on. Come on out. Feel it, people. A little bit stronger <laughs> Put a little bounce in your step Help one another along love about this, you know, the industry has changed in commercials and voiceovers, everything with technology. It's just gotten smaller and, you know, user-friendly and all that. But very often, people that are older are technically challenged. Technically challenged, Lynn, but you do editing and everything. You're all fabulous. Yeah, I think, I, I, you know, when I was a kid, that's what they told me I had to be. I wanted to be an actor, and and in school they said, no, I had a propensity for engineering, because I used to take things apart. 
Ah, see, so she's putting a little bounce in her step, doing her thing. Just a little bit stronger. Put a little bounce in your step. Help one another along. You'll feel the power. Put a little bounce in your step. And every day you will get just a little bit stronger. Put a little bounce in your step. Help one another along. It's about getting better as we get older, mm. which you certainly are, Bob Caliban. I wish I were. I I'll tell you something. Um, what, what you mentioned before about your age, that you don't feel that way and you certainly don't want to go back. Do you know the most important question to ask yourself about age? Yes. That is, how old would you be yeah. if you didn't know how old you are? How old would you be? everybody should ask themselves that very question. I love that. Now, I That's would great. not be... 55. Okay. But I also am not my age, which is 78. 78? I would be... I love that. Wait, a little applause in the studio, please. I like the sound effects. A little applause. Thank you. <laughs> Fabulous. But Amazing. I would be about 64 or 65 because I still work out. I still play tennis. I play uh, golf. I, I am very energetic. My mother and father... They never had this occasion. They just worked. Yes. That's all they did for their whole life. Well, it was a different time. It was yeah, a different was, time. Yes. That's what it, when you said it's so different now yes. and what it, what people are doing. Yes. So I looked at you and said, no, but if you ask yourself, you wouldn't be 53. Right. Well, I, you know, I'd be about 12. Because I'm the maturity level. There you but go. maybe not. Maybe not. I was very fluffy when I was 12. That's right. right. I was just, you know, kind you of heard a fluffy about kid. That. Yeah, you heard about that with the fluffiness. Feel the beat, people. Just feel it. Inhale through the nose. You got it. Inhale through the nose. Exhale through the mouth. Again. Inhale through the nose. Exhale through the mouth. Got it. Great big smile. Again, this is Marina. You're listening to High Energy Fitness Musical Health Talk. We're at 136 beats per minute. I'm here with Bob Caliban, Lynn Lipton, Brandon Osborne. Feel the beat, people. You got it going on. A little bounce in your step today. Come on, feel it. Oh, yeah. A little bounce. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. A little bounce. Oh, yeah. Come on along. True. It's like the old cliche of energy begets energy. So, you know, if you never stop moving, kind of like you don't age at all. I mean, time stands still. No, Lynn? Oh, I love it. I, I do yoga. And Ooh. yoga is when you talk about breathe through your nose, breathe through, you know, it's, yes. it's you know, you always breathing. If you stop breathing, well, you're dead. Yes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But in yoga, that's the most important thing is to keep breathing. And, yes. and uh, it keeps you very, very young. And, you know, as a vocalist, I mean, you guys are vocalists. And I always talk about uh, being a vocalist uh, similarly to an athlete or somebody that does martial arts with a key eye or somebody that plays a wind instrument. Circular breathing, the ability to inhale through the nose and control the breath as you let it out is very important. And you guys have been vocalists, especially in the studio, where you've had to control that breath. And that mm -hmm. is working your core. That is fitness. Yeah. He's the best. He was always the best. Always. He's still the best. Always. Never. Doing that. You always. Know. My name you is ask him Peter to take Thomas. a second off. Well, no, no, no. no. <laughs> Thomas, another okay. one. Fabulous. Oh, Remember yeah. the great joke? You know, business is getting a little slow. I saw Caliban eating lunch. Yeah, <laughs> you see that? Sitting down. Sitting, Sitting down. down. <laughs> Not standing in the studio. Yes, That's right. exactly. Well, you were always very considerate. You never spit at anybody or no, anything. No, never tried that. And you were good. <laughs> you were good with that. You did the Hollywood video campaign, did you not? Did you do Hollywood video for Cliff Freeman? Did you do voices with that? Because I talked to Brian Stack the other day. Yes. Brian. Oh, I did, yeah. yeah. Brian's doing Conan O'Brien out yes, in L.A. Yes, yes. I did it uh, probably 25 times with uh, 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 him here in New York. In New when York, he was yeah, New York. Me too. Amazing, amazing. Because, you know, he was walking to work the other day in Los Angeles, Brian, and I got him on a phone, on a phone patch, and he did the show while we were walking. Oh, that's and great. It was unbelievable, and he was happy that it worked in with the theme of the show. You will notice the tempo is now up uh, to 156 beats per minute. Song is called Never Stop Moving, and the lyric I've written is Keep Improving. They know all about that today, guys. Feel the beat. You got it. to 
to Luigi's 87th birthday party the Luigi's. other day. Oh, Luigi's. Oh, my God. Luigi. Oh, he was 87. The best. 87. Never stop moving. Oh, those baby. hip movements across the, the, best. the floor. Oh, the best. Of course, best. we love him. Oh. And I told him that I, I stopped drinking a year ago. You know, I keep improving, never stop moving. And I love this expression, never stop moving, because I stole it from Luigi. Here comes the chorus again. Here we go. <laughs> and schmitzing and exhausted and I, I don't know what's happening. But we're going to do like a slower pace thing in our second segment and we're going to work out in the chair. Are you down for that, Lynn? Oh, fantastic. fantastic. What do you think, Bob? In I'm the chair. I'm already lying in my chair now. So <laughs> there you go. Me. We're going to get him moving. Brandon? Mm -hmm. Yeah, oh yeah, absolutely. Absolutely. Let's do it. Our daughter is a yoga teacher. I don't know all She's this amazing, stuff. by the way. His your, daughter. Your daughter? Yes. She's a great teacher. Well, we're going to talk about her in the second <laughs> segment. Kathy Nolan. Oh, we're going to talk about her. Bob Caliban, Lynn Lipton, Brandon Osborne in the studio. You got it, guys. We'll be right back. I've got it moving.